We started with Headphone X. Okay. We're now, by volume, I think over 40% of all gaming headphones choose to use our technology. Wow. Hi everyone, Patrick again from Tech The Lead, and we're here with Dara Balasti, VP Mobile Products at Xperia. So thank you hey, for, thank good you for being you. here. Hey, good to see you. Thanks very much. We've been here a lot at Xperia talking about Xperia's technology in LG's new phones. Mm -hmm. um, but we also know that there's audio in there too from Xperia. Can you mm -hmm. speak a little bit about that? Sure, absolutely. It's, um, so thanks for having me. Um, it's great to be here. It's also great to be at Mobile World Congress 2019. I can't believe it's another year. Um, we've been working with LG over the last couple of years delivering our DTSX line of products um, and they're products designed to deliver immersive audio out of a phone so how do you deliver a better experience for music, movies, gameplay and we're delighted to announce with them uh, they announced on Sunday phone launching shortly that again they're using a version of our product DTSX exclusively for LG where we worked with them both to deliver enhanced space, dialogue enhancement and immersion on the latest G8 ThinQ device. Also, as they announced, we're on the V50, which is their first 5G phone. So, exciting times right. and really happy to be here. All right. Well, yeah, so one of the things that I want to key in on what you just said is the gaming aspect of the mobile experience. What are the trends like in mobile gaming and how is DTS and Xperia prepared to tackle those trends? Okay, so really good question. Um, if we look at how mobile gaming has evolved, um, some really interesting numbers, right? So PC gaming, console gaming, if you think of PC gaming, it's about a $30 billion industry. If you look at mobile gaming 2018, round numbers, it's a $60 billion industry. 40% of game developers today are also now developing directly for mobile games. So, how do we get, where do we see that as a trend? Yeah. Mobile games have evolved and are continuing to evolve from really simple Tetris, right? We were talking about Tetris just off camera. Right. You go from Tetris to Angry Birds, something where sound doesn't play a huge part right. and a lot of times where people don't actually turn on the sound in a game. Okay. You look at that and now you look at console quality gaming, so something like a Fortnite, right. which is going to go across all platforms. And we're seeing a really big trend as people are trying to create, particularly in action games and shooter games, they're trying to create a competitive difference through sound. Okay. That's where DTS comes in. right? So DTS has been in the, the, the industry of sound for over 20 years. Um, when we look at the gaming headphone market, about three years ago we launched a product called DTS Headphone X, was designed to give you better immersion. So, you know I was going to ask you the question, Patrick, yeah. what's immersion? Well, I think of immersion as kind of being in that space. If I'm playing a video game, I want to be where the character is, you know? Yeah. So there's a couple of things. So you're dead right. So yeah. we, we kind of call it the, um, the ABC of immersion, right? I want to make sure that sound can come above, sound can come from below, sound can come close to me. Right, you've got to take that from the horizontal plane where we're used to sound to sounds coming from here to out here. And that matters because if you're playing a first person shooter and there's a sound here, there's a chance somebody is behind you about to stab you, right? Or about to shoot you. So the competitive edge that you get knowing where a sound is coming from, together with, as you say, immersing yourself in that game so it makes it more believable, those are two of the key elements that we deliver. We started with Headphone X. We're now, by volume, I think over 40% of all gaming headphones choose to use our technology. Wow. This year, um, we've done a lot of work with Microsoft and we'll be launching on both PC and Xbox with our Headphone X headphone solution and also with our DTSX Ultra speaker solution. So when you think about, um, when you think about the mobile landscape, now we want to say, how do I deliver that same console experience over a phone, over a tablet, over a PC? Because if we're playing each other, you don't want to have a competitive advantage. I don't want you to have a competitive advantage on the PC. And we're trying to take that out of the platform. Now, for us, there's a number of things we've had to do because obviously Android is not an object-based audio system. 
So there's certain limitations that we're trying to overcome. Right. We're launching this year a program called DTSX Game Audio. Okay. What we're doing is working with developers to enable you know, immersive, true immersive audio to get from the game. Yeah. And when it's connected to a phone that supports DTS, then you get true immersion. Now, you look at examples, obviously um, the LG ThinQ downstairs is a great example of a phone that does that. Yeah. We're also on the uh, Oro G phone, one of the best reviewed gaming phones out from 2018. We're also on the Nubia Red Mars 2 device. We're also on the Vivo phones. So we're seeing that this category yeah. of gaming is not only growing as a device category, right. but it's growing as a device category tied to a gaming content strategy. One of the key things that DTS is good at as a brand is building content ecosystems and supporting content ecosystems, just like we've done in the cinema, right. as we've done in gaming in the past. Right, so you're, you're essentially saying you're taking the competitive advantage I would get on a PC, let's say, with my multiple speaker system and putting it straight to your mobile gaming experience. 100%, yeah, I mean, we're, right. I, our goal is to take that same experience right. you get as a con hardcore console right. gamer, yeah. now a hardcore PC gamer, right. If I want to take that out and go mobile, right. you know, the audio should go with you. Right. And that becomes important as more and more, you know, if you look at what Steam are doing in terms of their multi-platform approach, look at what Microsoft is doing in terms of their multi-platform approach, everybody is trying to get, right. you know, they want to own the consumer, right. they want to own the game and the game distribution and therefore the experience. So we're just supporting that across multiple platforms and devices. Right. That makes a lot of sense. Yeah, well, the, thank you. Yeah. Um, it's, uh, it, I mean, it's, you know, it's super fun to work in, right? right, right. So that's kind of cool. Right. With the industry growing so rapidly, with what yep. with 5G around the corner, and as you mentioned, foldable screens, that's something I never imagined, yeah. you know, in a million years. How is DTS prepared for the future of audio? Ah, so, okay, it goes back to the same thing. Yeah. If you look at mobile as an industry, yeah. mobile is actually pretty saturated. Okay. Right, so growth in raw numbers of new consumers, yeah. we've, we've penetrated most of the planet. Right, so the raw numbers of mobile are going to grow in the low single digits over the next few years. What's happening though with 5G and other things is people are looking for how do I differentiate? What are the ways that I can do to take my five and a half to six inch black or now colorful rectangular brick and say how do I, how do I make myself different from the device beside me? Sound is obviously one of those key elements. So when we look forward, going back to the two trends we're talking about, one is there's new and innovative ways that people are trying to push the barriers with raw speaker design and making that better. Right. We deliver software that helps. Gotcha. We deliver low power solutions that help people when they're putting it into, so when they're doing Bluetooth headphones, yeah. they're talking about wireless speakers, when they're talking about something that matters about power. Yeah. So we're gonna continue down that path. That problem is not gonna go away. Okay. When we look at the other side, when we focus on the high end, yeah. it is all about immersion, competitive edge, yeah. growing and building an ecosystem for gaming, and that's right. one of the areas that we're, we'll be focusing on, and you'll see a lot more coming from us. Again, if we have this conversation next year, right. we'll be able to talk about titles that are shipping with right. GTS, we'll be able to talk about the new content ecosystems that have been lighting up for gaming. Because right. again, gaming grows at 20%, so it's about, if you, if you, think, of, if you think of the mobile market, as being one static market that isn't changing, you've got to look for differentiation. And our customers are saying, what do I do? What do I do in terms of audio that will help me right. position and sell my device? And that's right. why they're looking at trends like gaming or wireless or something that helps with convenience. Right. So that makes yeah. So it sounds like DTS is really prime for the future, for the now, for really creating an environment that, as you said, is immersive, low power, that does everything a consumer might want, and even a competitive person, a gamer, might want as well. And, yeah, you know? I, I mean, so we, look, we've been doing this for 20 years. Yeah. Um, I've been in this company for um, seven to eight years. Yeah. One of the things about DTS that I absolutely love is DTS is a technology company, right? That company is part of Xperi. Xperi is a much bigger brand with a yeah. much bigger portfolio that talks about whether it's passion about audio, right. passion about imaging, yeah. passion about delivering driver monitoring systems right. um, into automotive, or when we look at the connected home, we're a bunch of engineers who are creative, flexible, trying to design what's next. Right. 
really life doesn't get a lot better than that. Right. So it's, yeah, it's, I, I see that the trajectory we're on, the path we're on is going to continue. We're seeing good growth. We're seeing good growth in our numbers, yeah. good growth in our products. Right. And again, finishing where we started, yeah. you look at the LG phone down, downstairs, right. LG G8 ThinQ. We have DTSX exclusively for LG as the audio solution. Right. We have our face safe product for biometrics. Right. We have our photography suite, so right. 3D portrait to help enhance photography. That's only the start, right? As you look and see that as a prototype, we're, we're increasingly building relationships with our partners to help them deliver better, faster, you know, with more differentiated solutions. All right. Well, if the products are anything like the LG smartphones, like we are about to be blown away by what Xperi DTS Photo Nation has to offer. So thank you so much for your time. No, real pleasure. Yeah. So keep up with Tech the Lead at Mobile World Congress Barcelona 2019. Hit that subscribe button and click the bell for notifications.